What's up everyone, thanks for checking out this video. I just want to let you guys know my PS4 Pro giveaway is ending very, very soon, in a few days. So if you haven't entered into this giveaway, it's real simple to simply leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't, and sometime go down below in the description and follow my Facebook. It's literally that simple to have a chance at winning this, so why not? But in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to have unlimited health with the Warlock. This is an amazing glitch and extremely freaking useful. You guys will see. But first, you have to have some sort of relic of some sort. You have to be holding something in your hands in order for this to activate. Or hey, maybe you could even get on your Sparrow at times to get this to activate, but you can't really get on your Sparrow that much in combat. So yeah, to get the best use out of this glitch is to use it during like Crotazoom when you have to pick up the relics, or going against Axis, you can pick up those rockets and have infinite health. Like literally anywhere. Right now I'm going to be demonstrating it in the Iron Tomb mission when I get to pick up the axe. So yeah, I'll get back to you guys when I get there. Alright, first off, to get this to work, oh, and by the way, the reason why my light level is so low is because I have herb benevolence on. But in order for this to work, all you need is transcendence on. That's it. To get this unlimited health glitch to work, you only need transcendence. And by the way, I'm going to show you guys after this one another little health glitch trick that you can use anywhere. But for now, I'm going to show you guys this. Because once again, this can be handy against a lot of raid fights. So I'm going to go ahead and scan this. Pick up this axe. Once again, it can be done with anything. So if you could pick up a sword somewhere, if you could pick up like a key that goes into a door. I don't know, you get the point. Anything that you could pick up, this can work with. Okay, so check this out. I'm going to go ahead and run up on this guy. I'm not worried whatsoever against this dude. My partner here is demonstrating that, you know, he'll die, but I'll still be alive. Kind of showing, like, the difference it can make. This guy is nothing, though. It gets more interesting when there's more enemies to go against. Right now, I really don't have nothing to worry about with my health at the moment. All right, here we go. More enemies are starting to drop now. Okay, that boss is done. Now, this is when things will get interesting. Hello, I am attacking you. See, I'm low there, but as you can see, I just regained my health that easy. Just by using my super and holding an X. Or whatever you have to use to pick up. Of course, it's going to be different for PlayStation. But yeah. You see that? Definitely handy. Okay, like I said before, I'm going to be showing you guys another way to heal yourself, which is shooting a snare with the red death. Now, there is a way I could test if this works with the Titan as well by shooting the spike grenade. If that makes this uh, heal me, then it can work with the Titan too. So yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Let him shoot me, and then heal, as you can see. It's not as effective as the um, Warlock method, because the Warlock method made you heal all the way. Oh my gosh, that was horrible. And this makes you heal partially. But yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and check if it works with this kind of grenade. Oh, looks like it doesn't. Let's try it again. Nope. Dang. So it seems like it only works with the snare. I mean, I can test with the Titan real quick, but I'm pretty sure it only works with the snare. If you guys want you can test it with the Titan if you feel like it. I just wanted to show you guys this because I feel like this could be handy for you all. Once again, that uh, Warlock way is definitely useful, I will say, especially on Curtison and whatnot. I'm out of here, though, everybody. If you guys found this enjoyable, consider leaving a like. It's greatly appreciated. And good luck to everybody that's actually entering into this giveaway. That's going to be ending soon. Until next time, though.